Next up, I am at Silver Moon Antique Mall and Collectibles. Uh, it's a little bit later than I had hoped. I've gotten a bunch, of, well, I've gotten, I've got, I got, gosh, I'm messed up, hold on. I got a bunch of good stuff already today and I'm ready to go look for more. Unfortunately, I'm still looking for trippy belt items, story of my life, found a bunch of stuff from my variety sales, but nothing yet for this train. So let's go in and see what we can find. Well, this wasn't here either last time I was here. Although I'm familiar with the, ooh, that's kind of pretty. Um, I'm familiar with the vendor from other antique malls. So I'm not as crazed as I would normally be when I see a new booth because I have a feeling the prices are gonna be a little close for what I'd like to pay. Oh my gosh, this uh, bluebird is still here. They marked it down 85, that's definitely still more than I'm willing to dish out. Look at that purple slag glass. That one's really pretty too. Trippyville, Trippyville, glass bird. Hmm. Oh, I love these little paperweights. And what is it? Ah, the tag's turned over. I think I saw that when the tag was turned around the right way the last time I was here, um, which is why I left it. Let's see. Frog planter. That's cool. $15. It's got a couple hairlines though, unfortunately. Otherwise, I would do it. Frog stuff like that usually does pretty well. Hmm. A lot of stuff that's close. Nothing I need yet. This is freaking cool. Wow. That's very cool. What about this? $24.50. Ooh, green. I love green. $35. Wow, this purse is beautiful. Is this glass? That's kind of crazy. Huh. So this is like my favorite vendor that I come up here for. She used to have a bunch of booths in uh, sled works. Frog shakers. $5. Those are cute. They're in really good shape. I'll take those. Um, she used to be in sled works. And then the sled works closed. So now I come all the way up here, but her booth looks extremely stocked. Whew, okay, deep breath. <laughs> this is kind of neat. $5. Yeah, her prices are so good. Oh my gosh. Purple. That's kind of cool. Five bucks. I'll take that. I like the handle on it. What? Dude. $6.99. I'll take that. Uh, this one's kind of cool. Seven bucks. I'll take that too. Oh my gosh. I still have like three more booths of hers to go. Oh, this is going to be nuts. Wait, wait, wait. Look at this blow mold. Five dollars. That's pretty great. Can't believe this basket's only fifteen. That feels like a good price. Candy dishes. That's kind of nice. The milk glass. What about the pink depression glass jar? That's twenty. All right. I feel okay leaving that. I've gotten such great deals today. Let's see. What else we got? This looks new. And jackpot. $12. I'll take that. Moon and Stars has been doing really well for me. This is very cool. This is uh, end of day pottery. $3. At least I'm pretty sure it is. Whatever. Three bucks. Can't go wrong with that. This is kind of cool too. $15. This one's only $12. So heavy though. It cost a fortune to ship that. And I'd have to ship it separately because I sell a lot of small, fragile stuff. This is also kind of curious to me. 22. That's really neat. I like the stripes on that. Neat color, too. 
kind of different. This is a really pretty color too, 20 bucks. Hmm. Maybe not. Oh, that dog got me again. I saw that. I love that thing. Uh, it's got a huge crack in it. It's little, kind of at retail. But this booth looks like it's been revamped too since last time I was been, uh, been here. Look, there's another one of those jackal um, and candy. Can't even think straight. There's so much going on. How much is that? 38. Okay, I can leave that. Ah, look at these guys. Or gals, I should say. That's just one of them. 18, 15%. That's a really good deal. A little bit more than I'd like to have invested. I feel like I did really well on those last year. 12 bucks, 26. All right. A little close so far on everything that I've really liked. A little Christmas dog left in $12. So I have a couple things like that coming up in my Christmas sale that I paid like half that for. So I feel pretty good about that. All right. Now, speaking of Trippyville, this, <laughs> this is new, but it's very trippy. <laughs> Marble eyes. This is kind of cool. Is this Blue Mountain Pottery? Looks like it could be six bucks. Not really my thing. I know it's a good deal though. If it is what I think it is, which I'm pretty sure it is. I'm being drawn to this blue ashtray. $12. That's pretty cool. Very heavy. Not sure how well I do on that. What about in here? Oh, those are not what I thought they were at all. Yo, it's a sun rubber poodle. 36, I actually have one in my poodle sale tonight. Um, the last time I bought one, didn't sell as quickly as they used to. So I'm not gonna pay $36 for one. Although a couple years ago, when I was in my prime on Etsy selling those, they went really crazy high. I think I sold one for 80 something and 90 something talk about trippy though again <laughs> i really cannot stand those creepy dolls i think they're the spookiest grossest thing they, they like smell like baby powder and they're just really unpleasant to the touch let's see what else we can find in here cute little santa claus 2.99 i think that's taiwan right oh no that's that's the sales sticker. Taiwan. It is Taiwan. No, it is two ninety nine. Three bucks. It's not a bad deal at all. It's in really good shape for three dollars. I'll take that. Now, this color stands out to me. Little glass ashtray. I used to sell these like crazy. I like the color on that. Let's see what else they have in here. Nothing too exciting for the price. I've just gotten such good deals that I've been a little spoiled today. All right, here we go. Another one of my favorite booths here. $2. I don't care that it's new, it's got a cat on it. <laughs> um, let's see, should I get both? It's kind of fun. Look at these funny pumpkins with the googly eyes. Eight dollars set of two. I kind of love them. Twenty percent off. Oh, it's like if you spend over a certain amount. Hmm. What's happening here? Archie cards. I am curious to get in here though. Let's see. Kind of like this. This is not what I thought it was though. Hmm. These are fun. Look, they've got strawberries on them. Japan, six dollars. Those are so great. Whoa. Okay, sixty-five. Look at this purse. Stop it. That's fabulous. Mushrooms. Fifteen. It's a little bit much. Not the craziest fan of brown. I do it on occasion, but I feel like they don't sell as well as other colors for me. Probably because I'm not excited about a lot of stuff that's brown. I'm not like a brown hater. I'm just not a brown fanatic. 
All right. Now there's a lot of things that look interesting to me here. Like this. It's kind of fabulous. The Santa. It's only $9. It's kind of great. Now what is... Oh my gosh. Look at this guy. Vintage rubber face toy. He's adorable. He's He looks like he's been redone though. I could be mistaken. There's something off about it. It's pretty fantastic. 25, that's a little bit more than I'd like to pay. I feel like my rubber faces have been kind of depreciated. I kind of love this though. It's more than I'd like to pay though. I'm being kind of stingy. Maybe stingy is not the right word. I just think that that's going to be pretty close to what I get for that after feast. Amazing. Now let's see what else we can find. Now the elves. Hello. Ten dollars. What's going on with this whole thing? Twelve fifty each. What about these? These are five dollars. Mm -hmm. Dude. Mm -hmm. Eight fifty. Five dollars. I'm gonna get both of these. And oh my gosh, this is so funny. Twelve fifty. Seventeen fifty. What is this one at? Twelve fifty. So they kind of that's kind of fun with the wishing well. Fifteen, that's a really good price for that. Acme one. I kind of love this. I'm weirdly into this jar. Why am I into this jar? $15. There's something kind of off about the, the top of that. I don't like how it's finished. It's been a while since I've picked up something like this. The prices in this booth so far have been really good. $20. That's definitely uh, bought retail on that. Oh, look at one of those. There's something off about the size of that. But still, I'm going to check it out. I could be wrong. No, I'm not wrong. That's new. Right? John Perry. I think that's newer. I feel like the older ones are smaller than that. Dude, I love this blue jar. That is sick. Oh my gosh. $35 for the pair. Can I get away with that? Is there a discount? 350. I feel like they'll give me 10%. They're so fantastic. Oh, I want to get them so bad. I think they're a little bit close. These are amazing too. Those are at 20. Again, a little close for me. This is really tempting though. Oh, I really want to grab them anyway, especially because like all the kitschy stuff I've liked today so far has been super close. I feel like it's usually the other way around. <laughs> um, it's just not been my kitsch day, which is kind of my thing, which is a little disappointing, but like I said, I found other good stuff, so I can't be too blown. This is neat. 60, 25, yeah. Uh, I like those face mugs too. Oh, and let me not forget to look in the teeny tiny. Is that a snail? Is that a freaking tenala snail? Oh my gosh, look at how sassy she is. She's fantastic. I kind of love her. Getting $12. Whoa, what's happening here? German Billy Bob teeth. $8. Train to Tribbyville. Here we come. Sold. There's this guy I'm like explaining <laughs> every booth. And he's like, oh, this is just junk. But it's actually not junk. This is... $14 and 25% off. It's very neat. I'm going to go ahead and take that. I like the teardrop shape. This seems to be missing its top, if I'm not mistaken. This is very cool. I don't really want to ship this, though. The prices are really good, though. $28, but then it's 25% off. I'm going to take the little teardrop base. I'm weirdly into this, too, even though it's new. It's kind of like the color combo and the mouth on it it's a little bit yonic which i think is what i'm into not to sound like a total weirdo it's definitely got some weight to it can we also talk about this decanter dude what 
I'm not gonna ship it, but it's pretty freaking epic. Wow, I really like that. <laughs> I was about to check out and I looked behind me and sitting right there is a vintage glass mushroom ornament for $1.50. Dude, what? All right, in and out. I spent $86 in there and now I'm off across the street to the consignment bar and I'll see you guys when I get there.